Hi guys, how are you today? It's me, Christine. Um, welcome to my channel, and if you're new, welcome to my channel, and if you're not, welcome back. Um, today, we got the Jeffree Star Halloween Supreme Box, and it just got dropped off. It's really raining outside, so if you hear a bunch of noise, it's the rain, and it's really windy. I have the the curtains open, but it's it's going to be a foggy day because it's already starting to roll in. Anyway, so I haven't opened it yet. It came pretty banged up, and there's stuff rolling around, so I hope it's all all good. It's cute. The box has little skulls on it. I think that's cute. So let's get her open. And if you hear my cat crying in the background, it's because I'm not holding her. And we're going through a phase of some sort. Oh, wow. Okay. Wow. All right. All right. So the first thing that I'm picking up is the Jeffree Star Shane Dawson mini controversy palette and I don't have that I have the conspiracy I did buy the mini but I gave it to my granddaughter okay oh it's the one with put it back in. And we all know that palette, so I'm not going to swatch it or anything. I like it. That's something I don't have. Okay, so put that to the side. And the cremated palette. I like that. I love my cremated palette and it's very used. We use it a lot on it during Halloween. My fiance even let me do a makeup look on him for Halloween last year. Or no, the year before when cremated first came out. Ooh. Okay, it's all intact. We know what it looks like. Very pretty. I'm really glad I got that one because there's some colors in the cremated that I love to use for Halloween looks. You know, when I do looks for the kids um, that are getting really low. Ooh, what's this? It's the Love Me, Love Me Not lip collection. I don't have that. Ooh. Very wearable colors. We got doll doll parts calabasas wifey watermelon soda anna nicole prom night red rum and unicorn blood all very wearable and nice fall colors that's so nice Okay, and we have the Weirdo palette. This is his new one. I hate to rip the paper. I love the stickers and the bubble wrap, but I hate to rip the paper. Okay, so here's the packaging. Very cool. Love the, the lettering. And of course, vegan, cruelty free. Oh, okay. So there's the front. This is really pretty. Wow. Okay, so there's there's just one shimmer. That's what the palette looks like. This here is showing up on the camera pink, but it's really, it's more red. It's called Scene Queen. Freak Show. 
Freak Show, 1985, and I can't even, it's too glare, it glares, I can't read it all. Let me put the plastic back on. <laughs> The, wind, the mirror was fogging up because it just came off the UPS truck and it's pretty cold outside. Cold and damp. Alright, we got something big down here. Looks like a mirror. It says black soft touch on the sticker. I haven't watched any of, um, spoilers, because I wanted to be surprised. <sighs> okay. Oh my gosh. Look at that. That's so pretty. Perfect for Halloween. I love it. Love, love, love that. Here, Gypsy, you can look at yourself in the mirror. Okay, so I got a cold digger, and I think, oh, it's an eyeliner. It's called cold digger, and it's like a brown, which I don't have a brown, so that's good. I like that. I'm not disappointed at all so far. I think the box is wonderful. I don't get upset by mystery boxes. That's the point. It's a mystery box. It helps companies. It's smart. It helps companies get rid of stock. All right. So this is Magic Star Luminous Setting Powder in Natural. I, I don't have any of his setting powders. Let's see. Ooh, that might be dark, though. Open. Oh, that's cool. Look, it has, like, open close. So, of course, I go to the close side, right? And there's a little sticker. And you pull it up. I'm going to take a brush. Watch out, Gypsy. All right. I got a clean brush. What do you do? Just do that. All right. So it's setting powder. Let me figure it out later. Okay. It's natural. It's feels nice. I don't like to put a lot of powder on because I have wrinkles and I like this. I'm into it. Something I don't have. All right. We have a velvet trap lipstick in Red Affair. I'm not a big red lipstick wearer. I'm not going to swatch it in case I give it away. There's the color. It's kind of like an orangish red. Very pretty. So, I don't know. I'm not going to swatch that because I might give that away. And I think that would be yucky to swatch. Alright, so we got a the gloss in Mouthful. I like his glosses. They're not weird. They don't get weird and sticky. <laughs> My cat's going to check it out. What do you think, Gypsy? These are just so hard to get out sometimes. Oh, okay. That's pretty. There's the doe foot. 
very wearable. It has some like, you can barely see it, see it there? Like gold, gold reflex. I like it. I'll be keeping that. I think Gypsy. And then we got um, a lip scrub. Which is brew. Oh, okay. There it is. That's cute. I like the colors. Oh, is that licorice? Okay, that's good. <laughs> I love his lip scrubs, but. I think, I think that's licorice. That's a weird taste. Alright, we have a liquid lip in Cherry Wet. And I don't, I think I already have Cherry Wet. I'm not going to swatch it. It's a very pretty color. If I have, don't have this, I'll keep it. If I do have it, I will give that away. And we got... Magic Star Pale Yellow What is this? Long wearing anti-aging properties natural matte finish full coverage Magic Star This must be a concealer or a corrector Let me go from the bottom it's in pale yellow. I think I already have a yellow undertone. I might have to give that away. Alright, I'm not going to take it the whole way out. That's what it looks like. I believe it's a corrector. Like concealer corrector. I'm not going to take it the whole way out. Because I want to go on his website and look it up. And see exactly what it, how it's used. But I have yellow undertones, so I don't think I should use something pale yellow. Okay, so next is a lip li uh, lip liner in Leo, and I do have Leo lipstick, so Ooh. it's a very wearable color as well, especially for fall. And there is Leo. And you can use his stuff in your eye, eye as eyeliner as well. So, keeping that. Alright, we've got single shades. One in F-U-C-K. Which is an orange. Very nice shade. I like this shade. Perfect for Halloween. And another single shade in Chameleon Fetish. Ooh, nice pretty green. That's pretty, huh? I'm not disappointed in this box at all. I love this box. I have it. Well, I, like I said before, mystery box is a mystery box. You didn't... Oh. Jeffrey Scott Star Skin coming soon. It says after years of formulation and testing, the skincare line you've always dreamed of is almost here. <coughs> Look at the jar. That's cool. All right. All right, Jeffrey. Ooh. And last but not least, it looks like a hoodie. I love hoodies. I have them hanging all over the place. That one in the back there, right there, that's from Star Lounge. And it says, hi, how are you on it? I love the colors of it. <sighs> okay, it's like orange. It's like pumpkin orange star. And that new star, that's really neat. And on the back, it's like it's like a muted 
pumpkin orange and brown brownish orange. Look how pretty. That is awesome. I got it in large because I always like to layer because I do live in Pennsylvania. And that's pretty big though. Do they send me a large? Because all those other ones that I bought are in large. Yep, it says large. Maybe it'll shrink a little bit, but it don't matter. I like them large. Because, like I said, I do live up north. And I don't like those coats that make that, no that s scuffy noise. So, I like to layer under hoodies. And hoodies are just more comfortable. So, there we have it. I mean, I'm happy with everything I got. Um... It's a lot of stuff, and I don't have any of this stuff. Nothing's a repeat, but possibly, I forget what I said, the Velvet Trap. I'm, I might, if, I might give that away. That's not a color I do. And the Cherry Wet Lip thing. So here's the weirdo. And I'm going to swatch Glamour Shot, Razor Blade, and Mohawk. And that's what they look like on the finger. That's the only shimmer. So, you're on my sleeve up. So, that's Glamour Shot, Razor Blade, ooh, and what did I say the other one was? Mohawk. I'm not a good swatcher, so, whoops. Pretty. Right, where's my wipes? Are you sitting on them, Gypsy? All right, we'll just use this sponge. Okay, so the next row is Punk Culture, Weirdo, and Only Child. So we're going to go with Punk Culture, Weirdo, Only Child. All right, so Punk Culture... Weirdo and only child. Nice, different. Nice dark palette for Halloween. And I know it was for his, you know, like reminiscing about his childhood and stuff like that. But what else? It's pretty. All right, the next we're doing 1985 Freak Show and Scene Queen. So there's 1985 Freak Show. And scene queen. So, 1985. Freak show. And scene queen. I'm not the best swatcher because for a girl, I got hairy arms. So, there's the colors. They're all matte except for the one shimmer, the razor blade, which is right there. Very pretty, very pretty silver. Um, nice Halloween palette, nice throwback palette. Reminds me of my punk rocker days. So, there we have it. There's the Jeffree Star. Um, Halloween mystery box in Supreme. I'm very satisfied with everything I got. And that is it. So, until next time. Bye.